Very few people in this country are successful without some form of post-secondary education. Education has the power to transform people's lives and I think everyone that I've met in my life has been affected tremendously, either good or bad, by the quality of the education that they receive. Our aspirations are still there, but if you look at what's happening in school districts across America, um, we're not making good on the promise for so many kids. It was very discouraging to watch a broken, a broken system and feel like I was a small piece of the broken system that couldn't really make a difference. And it's striking uh, across America how different um, education outcomes are for, for those different student groups. I started Education Pioneers to build a national network of leaders and organizations working to transform urban education. Scott said, can we grab a little bit of time? I'd like to tell you about this thing I'm thinking of doing, this notion of summer employment in education enterprises with grad students who are either in business or law or policy between their first and second years. I realized pretty, pretty early on that being in the classroom wasn't the path for me and that my talents would best be used helping existing organizations achieve their next level of impact. So it was a perfect interim experience after a year in business school to be able to go into um, you know, an entrepreneurial educational nonprofit, apply the skills that I had learned in business school along with skills that I had prior to coming into business school. I think the other thing is it's not do you want to work in education, it's are you interested in solving the, the biggest, hairiest, um, civic and economic problem this country is facing. We need more great leaders in education and at Education Pioneers we're trying to find really smart, talented leaders. You know when you go to graduate school your network tends to be people with the exact same interest area. So if you're in business school you have a network of business school friends. If you're in nonprofit or in policy school you have a network of policy um, um, colleagues. So Ed Pioneers brought together all of those different interest areas um, all towards the same goal of supporting schools and, and, and forwarding education. But the, the the backgrounds of the people in the cohort were completely different from what I saw and interacted with every day at graduate school. And the idea is that getting them exposed to that kind of cross-pollination and um, mix of traditional and non-traditional backgrounds at this stage will be something that they will see the benefit of and then seek to replicate as they grow in their career. So you've got talented, passionate organizations matched with talented and passionate young entrepreneurs who have an amazing summer experience. During my first year of graduate school, I had identified DonorsChoose.org as a nonprofit organization that I would be really interested in exploring career opportunities with when I graduated. Um, I was a teacher originally and had used DonorsChoose as a, as a teacher user um, and was interested in opportunities to work there full time. During the Education Pioneers Fellowship, Charles Best, who was the CEO and founder of DonorsChoose, ended up being a panelist on one of the Ed Pioneers Fellowship workshop days. So I was able to get on his radar and it remained on his radar and upon completing graduate school I ended up um, accepting a position at Donors Shoes. When I began my job search I had a network of hundreds and thousands of people um, who would know relevant jobs in the space and would be able to not only um, connect me with those jobs but also give a good reference. I'm inspired to go to work every day um, because I really am passionate about educational reform. Every single day in the building, um, I'm interacting with students who are benefiting from the work that I'm doing here. And until everyone has the same type of education opportunities that I have, um, I'm motivated to come to work every day. My primary job right now is to finance and then renovate our second school campus, which is going to be about a half a mile away. I talk with the students and with the parents and the staff about what I'm doing every day, and it's very rewarding. There are also opportunities to put hybrid skills, business skills, policy skills, analysis skills, um, to work in the nonprofit sector as a way of getting at education um, from a different uh, point of view. And so now we're having some needs in the district, and I'm reaching throughout the alumni um, 
network of education pioneers to hire directly into these roles. I would not be where I am now without Education Pioneers. You know, the fact that I met Don Chalvey, the founder of Aspire Public Schools, during my Education Pioneers summer internship um, and kind of forged that relationship early on. When I work with them, you can see a difference. You can see a difference in the quality of their industry knowledge, the quality of their networks, and their networking skills. They are absolutely willing to give back and train the next generation. That's the kind of talent that Education Pioneers draws, and it's the kind of talent that school organizations need at bigger and bigger scale. And I think what we're seeing in education today is the status quo is not acceptable. And we need to bring in new energy, new thinking, to work with the individuals in the system. I mean, in my mind, the pioneers ought to be in the 100 neediest urban areas in this country. We've grown dramatically from 2004 when we launched with, with one site and nine fellows and seven partners. Um, but I feel like um, we've got big things ahead of us, and we're just scratching the surface. President Obama has challenged our nation to lead the world in college graduation rates by 2020. If we're going to get there, if we're going to achieve that ambitious goal, we've got to have smart, talented people um, working in a number of different roles and for a variety of different organizations. That is key for our success as a nation in education and that we at Education Pioneers play a unique role in moving that work forward.